Now, thank you for staying with us. Rory McElroy and Erica Stoll most definitely held the wedding of the year in this country. But across the Irish Sea, Pippa Middleton's marriage to multi-millionaire James Matthews have been capturing all the media attention for months now. Yes, so amid tight security and secrecy in the run-up, did her big day live up to all of those expectations? Well, here to give us the goss are avid royal followers, DJ and author Nikki Hayes and Ashling O'Toole, who's the editor of You magazine. Good morning to you, ladies. Good yeah, morning. morning. Much speculation yesterday. Uh, the shots, actually, of the dress came in literally as we closed the show yesterday, which was a shame right, because yeah. it would have been nice to give viewers a shot of the dress. Uh, Nikki, let me come to you first. Uh, the big day, tell us th about the groom. Uh, you know, he didn't look great. <laughs> oh, God. Well, it was her day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, in fairness, like, I mean, mm. there was a lot of guests who actually upstaged him hugely, uh, one being Ro Roger Federer, who looked mm. amazing, very dapper. Um, but, yeah, I mean, he's a multimillionaire, billionaire. Mm. Um, he is brother to Spencer Matthews from, is it Made in Chelsea? Made in Chelsea, yeah. yes. Um, so he's James Matthews, is he? Yes, yes. and he literally... He's 41. And he's got a lot of money. Okay. Now, lot she, of money. she has a bit of a history in this, right? Because her previous boyfriends were all multi-millionaires, financiers or investment yeah. managers or whatever. She wasn't going to marry the local plumber, was she? No, it wasn't going to be a Denton Abbey go off with the servant and a half. No, no. no. She, has a, she has a type, doesn't she? She certainly <laughs> she does. Has a type. My, my mother used to say, don't love for money, but love where the money is. And I think uh, Pippa took that to I the think extreme. Yeah. Carol might have maybe had a, yeah, a similar yeah. mantra for her girls, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so talk to us about the wedding. Um, we saw lots of, lots of access to it, lots of shots yesterday. Mm. Um, beautiful dress. Did you like the dress? Absolutely stunning, yeah, yes. really. I mean, I didn't expect her to come out in a ball gown or anything anyway but um i thought it was just very elegant mm -hmm. and uh, very pretty she looked she looked quite great. traditional i thought it was really modern i was actually mm. quite surprised i expected her because she both of both herself and kate are very traditional conservative dressers so yes. i expected it to be quite dull i was actually really really surprised by how modern it was with the neck and apparently it was made so there's no seams either so it looks like it's just all one one piece lovely mm -hmm. and, and who is it yeah. it's giles deacon uh, which, which I was surprised by as well, because the only other bride he's ever dressed was Abby Clancy. Okay. So mm. from wag to royal, it's a bit of yeah. a bit, yes, bit of a yeah, jump. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah no, I, I loved it. I thought it was great. What, 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 I, did, what I did notice were the guns, you know, um, Pippa's guns. Did She'd been that? working Three on them. Months working work on, on those arms. And I bet you she had a pile of weights in the bottom of the flowers as well, just to show them off. <laughs> show them off. <laughs> well, <laughs> she didn't have a hair out of place, um, no. literally. She I mean, they did a zoom perfect. on her, and her chignon was to one side, and her, her veil, her perfect. What? Chignon. What's a chignon with a bun? A shiny bun. A bun. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> but she looked amazing. I mean, makeup, everything, yeah. you know, perfect. There was nothing wrong with her whatsoever. But she kind of had to. I mean, after the reaction to her Bomber Kate's wedding, she couldn't really oh, yeah. now look at fall this down on her own. This is yeah. just beautiful, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, of course. Yeah, so we're seeing the Kate boys yeah. and the little girls. These are all part of the wedding party. So this is post-ceremony. Yes. yes, and there's a lot of lols when it comes to the kids as well. Um, they weren't exactly behaving themselves. As they should, you yes, know, just well. to be kids have fun. There's one picture, I don't know if we have it, of uh, one of the kids um, flipping the V, I think it's known as. There he <laughs> is. This. And th th they've actually blanked out the, the, the two Do you fingers. know what the yeah. best part of that is? Kate's, Kate's face. face. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because every parent has been so there. You're in so much trouble. You're so yeah. dead. Wait till I get you home. Wait till I get you home smiling. Yeah. Grimacing, yeah. The young prince as well, he actually had a moment where he threw a tantrum. Yeah. And uh, again, you see Kate go, I'm going to get you home. Yeah, <laughs> so, yeah. It's cute, though, isn't it? Yeah. You know? So James is chief executive of Eden Rock Capital Management Group in London, so hedge fund. Mm -hmm. Named after his parents' resort in St. Bart. In St. Bart's, well, Eden you know. Rock, yes. Yeah. Um, his, his mum was one-time receptionist for Christian Dior. Mm, okay. Uh, it's more Spencer, I think. He's such a dirty dog. I'm, so, I'm <laughs> raging he was so well behaved. <laughs> Spencer <laughs> is, is the groom's brother. Yes. And Spencer goes out with Vogue Williams. Yes. yes. All right. So mm. Vogue wasn't at the wedding. Vogue no. was not. So apparently there was a no ring, no bring policy, which I don't think was literal. I think it was more Vogue and Spencer only together since January. Mm. So maybe it was more of a long-term partners only kind of invite. Mm. Okay. Well, how about Harry and uh, his one? What's her name? Oh, Meghan, Meghan Markle, Markle wasn't Markle. there either. No, she was. She, came, she, she went to the night. Oh, she got the after's mm. nod, did so she? So no. apparently, I, was, I properly now was dying to see her yesterday. <laughs> so I was looking yeah. into this. She didn't come to the wedding because she thought her presence might garner far too much attention and take it away from Pippa. But Harry did go and pick her up afterwards yeah. for, for the party. Come on, Harry. But we've no In idea what she wore. Us. Eight, was it? Oh, wow. Uh, I will take your word on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, we just saw a footage of Donna Eyre as well. So tell us her connection. Mm. She 
is going out with ja with Pippa's brother James, and they've been together on and off for a couple of years. Right. Mm -hmm. She was my best dress. I thought she looked incredible. She looked stunning. She You're did. absolutely yeah. right. Yeah. So that's more of a long-term relationship. Yeah. Yeah. She got the nod. So tell me, um, the the dress uh, Pippa versus wedding dress versus Kate's wedding dress. Who won the the dress Ooh. off? Pippa. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. I think yeah. so. Yeah. Kate yeah. and Jen. I mean, even Kate's outfit yesterday. She's beautiful. She always looks great, mm. but she's always so classic and mm. don't want to say boring, sen Mumsy. sensible. Mumsy. She's a bit yeah. safe. Yeah. She's yeah. accused of being a little bit safe sometimes. Yeah. And I mean, she wasn't allowed to be bridesmaid because of the etiquette where, you know, she was already yeah. married. So that's why she was looking after things, making sure Pippa was okay, but officially not anything. So okay. she wasn't matron of honour or anything no, like that? No, nothing of no. that. No, no, no. She oh, they're very strict in their rules, aren't they? Well, apparently, you were saying, we're, that's here in Ireland too, but we just don't stick we to think it. Yeah. We're Irish, we ignore yeah. the rules. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and the venue for the wedding? Was in her parents' back garden. Oh. Now, <laughs> With the back garden like my back garden. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, she flew in um, a glass orangery from Belgium, as, as, as you do. So now, Marquis. They reckon two hundred and fifty thousand pounds the wedding cost. Oh, and that's the rest. I'd say that's the change. Rest. Yeah. Is that change? Oh, yeah. oh yeah. So yeah. the dress was forty grand. Was it? Yeah. Her ring was two hundred grand. She won in the ring off for her in case. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. you, see, you well, see loads of photographs of anybody online all day today, yeah. and I'm sure oh, they'll be yes. everywhere for the next couple of days. Yes. Yes. For those of you who are interested. Yes. Everyone, well, everyone's interested. <laughs> everyone's was, interested in this It was this trending number one yesterday. <laughs> so. have to just wait for Harry and Meghan now, I think, for the next yeah. Oh, one. yeah, that'll be a good one. Okay, yeah. thank you, ladies. Thanks, Thanks girls. Thanks. Up next, more holiday styles on the catwalk. Stay with us.